about rear lights. Yeah, go right through it. You can park my truck right here. Alright, so once again, we are at the Ford dealership. Four years later. Let's go ahead and see what they have in the lot. And we're also going to see what they have inside. Looks pretty promising from the outside. Man, look at that 2020 Chevy. They got lights still in there, everything. Some should reserve for somebody. Alright, what do they got out here? They have F-150 Lariat. They got a couple F-150s out here. I wonder what's the MSRP on these. I think they go for like 55k or something like that. Not bad at all. I like the color on this one. What color is this? Dang, that's, that must be that new red that they got for the uh, 2020 models. That's a nice color. Man, look at the interior on that thing. Wood, green, stitching. Sunroof, panoramic sunroof. Very spacious in there too. He's looking pretty official right now. Look at that. Okay. I like that. I like that F-150 lineup. That's a little nice. I like that. Over here we got the uh, Eco Boost. Okay. So this Eco Boost right here. Looks like a premium package Mustang GT. Look like. The interior look pretty decent on it. Got the dash. Look to be a manual. Okay, that's a manual. I like the way that look. That's clean. I like the red on it. Looks dope. And we got this white eco boost right here. That don't look. That don't look half bad either. Got that 2.3 <laughs> twin turbo. I like that. That's nice. Like you got the tang a tangerine Mustang. This looks like it's a 10 speed. Oh, yeah, that's a 10 speed. Man, I like the color on these tangerine Mustangs. They look fire. They look really fire. We got over here, we got a blacked out Mustang. This looks to be another manual. I think the MSRP on these are like 40 some K. These aren't that expensive. I like that. I like that. That's clean. That's clean. Alright. What the guy over here? They got a little boot mustang right here. Hey, that's even clean. Okay. Okay, okay. Looks like they got the GT500 back in. They have a little lot. They got a few Mustangs. They got Tangerine Mustang. They got some trucks. Let's go inside and see what they got. It's been a long time since I've been in here. They got the calendar. They got that old calendar on here. Okay. What we got here? We got 2020 Shelby GT500. Got that nice red with the white stripe. All right. I think these go for like 80k now. These these, look, these cars literally just came out, and I think somebody bought this one because they got a plate on it. 2020 GT500. Okay. I see you. they got they got it aha this is what i'm looking for 2020 explore st Let me see what's got on this. Sure, i don't even know the msrp on one of these things but i like this black oh my god that black is so different 
Like, look at that thing in blacked out. That looks fire. Freaking light is black. This black is clean. Got the blink license plate. Waiting for somebody to clean it. Oh yeah, I like that. That's nice. That's real nice. We got that old Ford GT. All right then. They trying to they trying to flex for real for real. Look at this whole whole 2017 Ford GT engine. I got a book in there and everything. Look at that. Top wow. They got a whole Top Gear freaking. That's crazy. These gentlemen look dope. Look at the interior on that thing. So it's not spacious at all though. That junk is cramped in there. We got another 2020 GT500 right here. It's a nice little gray. They got a lot of cars in here. Shoot, I don't even know what color this is. It's like a grabber, not like grabber. It's like a not like destroyer gray, but it's like a gray with a white pearlescent. It ain't sweet. It ain't real sweet. I got the back. It ain't sweet. I got the black. F-150 Shelby Raptor right here, okay. What that see right there? 755 horsepower? Jeez. And a truck? Looks like they tried to freaking outdo the uh, track hawk. Check it, lifted and everything, okay. Got the Shelby Raptor, look at the interior on that thing. I want to get these one day. Panoramic roof. That joint is lifted. Ooh, this joint sound. I'm gonna test drive that next time I come here. So I'm gonna come back here. But alright, baby. This dealership looking nice. I, I, I like this little Mosley's dealership. Go ahead and walk out of here though. They don't got the they, they don't got the, like the full on explorer lineups. So I need to go to the other dealership. Let me go over there. Make sure the road clear, yes sir, yes sir. Is that right there? You got a Hellcat right there? Hey, they got a whole challenger right there, okay. I'm gonna see if this dealership will be has one. They probably do. Yeah, see how look they lined up they lined up looking fresh already over there. Just pulled up. Got the Mopar dealership over there where I got my Hellcat right there. Let's see what they got over there. Oh yeah, they got a lot of 2020 Explorers over there. Yes sir. Man, they got a bunch of them over there. Explore, explore here, explore there, explore everywhere. Oh yeah, give me an explorer. Far back here.
sake of the box, it is 2013. Let's see how we'll to the 2020. All right, let's see if I make sure I get everything in. Man, this must be his car right here. Got a little Miata or something. He got that little Miata. Let's go and see what he got. Hey, got the new bottles all over there. Jeez, got a little clean up here. Bags all day, all day. Let's see what they got here in the lot. Hey, what's going on, man? How you doing? Hello, my name is George. How are you doing today? Doing good. Just about to uh, search the lot to see what I'm about. I'm about all me. right, well, uh, I just want to give you one fair warning. The uh, pickup truck right there, the uh, King Ranch, has already been sold. So unfortunately, that is not for sale. So if you are looking for a 2020 Explorer, you came to the right place. All right, perfect, perfect. I'm just going to take a look at All right. Here. Let me see what you have. Well, let me start out. Starting right here to the left is going to be the cheapest version of the STs. It's literally the base price of 55000 as we go up, they're going to gently increase in value. Um, this one right here is a very specific, unique color red that we only had two of, and uh, one of them was already bought by a private collector. The most expensive one we have that is fully loaded is this blue one right here. Mm. All three of these have everything. The blue one literally just has everything that is offered for this model year. So if you're looking for the ST, so you still want the twin turbo six cylinder and the lighter suspension package, but you don't want to pay the uh, 60, I think this one is, let me check the sticker real quick here. Yep, just as I thought. Yep, this one's uh, 64,000 for this one right here, the blue one. And I believe this frost white one right here is about, let's see. Yep, this one is 53000 So, a $10,000 price difference from end to end. Hmm. And though this one is also white, if you'll gently notice, that one is what you would call ice white. This one is their frost white. So, I they're different shades. Like the sun shines on it. Yeah, this one's got a lot more of a shimmer to it, if you will. Whereas that one's just more of your typical solid white but just more of like a cream color. Is there uh, any questions I can ask uh, or answer? Not right now. I'm just going to go and check one of those. The blue one. I like, the, I like this color. Yep, the blue is also very nice. Uh, we have a few of them in this color coming. This is currently the only one we have in stock. Um, but the blue is quite nice. I do like the blue. Uh, we have a, uh, this one's a, uh, special edition that was pre-ordered, but the buyer backed out on, so it is blacked out entirely. Ooh. Oh, the blacked out one? Oh, yeah, I like this one. I like the color on this. I don't know why, but to me, these black ones look so aggressive. And then, uh, this red one is a very nice color red. We've only had two and we'll only have two in this color. And, uh, this is the second one. We sold the other one literally three days ago. So this is the only other one you're gonna, we're gonna have in this specific color of red. Because as you can see, this one's just standard red. Mm -hmm. And the difference is quite, quite a lot. It's like it got like a fleek in it. It's like... It's like when the sun shines on it, it's like brown. If I like it a lot. I think it is a very beautiful color. And it's quite not a very uh, common color, if you will. It's like, it's like red in the sun and brown in the shade. I like that. And then over here, I actually... Yep. All three of these ones are the same price, except for this one. 
because this one's got the uh, twin panel sunroof, whereas this one's just got the standard sunroofs. I think it's called Burnt Forest. Burnt Forest, oh, okay. It's like a like a very dark green that in some lights almost looks black. Granted, in the current climate, Burnt Forest isn't uh, probably the best term. But that is what the color is. <laughs> Who am I to judge? I drive a Miata. I've seen, I've seen it in a uh, lot in the parking lot. I drive a 13 Explorer. I'm trying to treat it in. Yeah. Yep, I, I saw you drive up in it. Yep, Cause we got, uh, if you're looking for another white one, um, I would definitely, even though this one's a little bit more in price, this one over that one, this one's got a lot more optional interior goodies. It's got the front massaging seats, the front and rear seat heaters, got navigation, full sync control, and uh, Bluetooth syncing with your phone as well. Now, I believe, starting from this black one here, moving this way, all four of these models are uh, fully loaded for the most part. This one has a few more options and a few more other things that the other, these other three don't have, but for the most part, they're all three the same. Hmm, okay, okay. I think I'm, I think I want to go for this, like this red one. Which one? This red one? Yeah, I like this one. I like uh, this one. Very excellent choice. This one's current price is $62,389. Hmm. Uh, were you looking to trade in your current one? Yeah. Alright. Uh, what year is your current one? And do you happen to know how many miles are on it? Uh, it's 2013, and I think I have like, uh, I'll probably say 30, 20, 30,000 miles on it. All right. Well, here, how about this? Why don't um, you give me a, your driver's license? I'm going to uh, send in a scan and back into our office real quick, and then we can trade keys. I'll go grab the VIN number from your vehicle. You can go take this one for a test drive real quick. Right. And then uh, by the time you get back, I'll have your trade-in price and uh, the calculated uh, cost that you'll have to pay for uh, this new one. All right, that makes all right. That works. That works. Here's your driver's license back, sir. Take this for a little test drive. All right, and I'll go take a look at your vehicle. All right. Thirteen did not have this much freaking detail. Look at all this. Oh yeah, I'm I'm gonna like this. I'm gonna like this very much. I'm going to go ahead and drive for a lot. I 
like this. This, this would be a good daily. Music play in the background, okay. Alright, now we're gonna punch over. My goodness, okay. Does give the speed. Same slope, the same slope. I can't test the dang on car because it's always real light. Sport mode yet. I'm gonna park right here real quick to see how it looks from the exterior. So, yeah, this is the 2020 Explorer ST. It's actually not bad. It's quicker than I freaking expected. This thing actually launches like crazy. I like the color on it too, but to the test. I put it in sport mode. I ain't trying to get no cocky on it. Alright, we're gonna drive up the street real quick one more time. Lights are really annoying. Ooh, look at that Tahoe. Ninja. Charlie. Oh, the heck? Okay. Alright. Last turn. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Explorer moving. Oh yeah, I like this thing. Oh, you liked it? Oh yeah, this thing, like, on the, uh, on a couple of intersections, I kind of punched the gas a little bit, and oh my, this thing takes off. Well, I talked to the bosses, and they said, uh, originally that they wanted to charge 48 for this with your trade-in, but I got them to drop down to 44. Okay, okay. Would that be something you're interested in? Yeah, let's do that. All right. What I'm going to have you do then is take yours back um, and take it to the dealership. And uh, I'm going to take this one there, have them take a look at it in the garage. We'll get the paperwork all filled out and we'll get you on your way. All right. All right, let's go to the other dealership. You know, he said he's going to meet us there. <laughs> I knew he was going to go back to that dealership. This explorer don't feel nowhere near as fast as that one here. That thing takes off. We got R33 up here. Yeah, R33 right there. Right, hello 2013 Explorer, it's time for you to say goodbye.
All right, sir, are you ready? Yes, sir. All right, I need you to sign two things for me, and I'd also like you to feast your eyes on the marvel that is my ride. I see, you got all you all this your Mustang? Yep, I got the Miata back at the other place because that's the daily, but this was, uh, this is the play thing. Okay. I let my kid Steve drive it a lot all the time. You'll probably see him around. Uh-huh. He showed me there again. Come on in. All right, let's see here. Let's turn this page right here. This page right here. All right, if you'll just come right over here, I need you to just sign this document right here at the bottom. All right. Oh, let me get out of your way there. Sorry, sir. You're good, you're good. Okay. All right, perfect. Now she is all yours. Let's go, brand new 2020 Explorer. I might go for this 2020 Shelby next. You never know. All right, the deal is done. 2020 Explorer is now ours. So I'm about to get ready to drive back home. It is getting really late, as you can see. Time to say goodbye to the 2013. Look at that thing! Look at that thing! Right? Oh my god! All right, sir. She's all yours. All right, thank you. Appreciate it. Yep. You have a great rest of your day now. All right. Dang, I gotta take a picture of this thing. Look at that. I just, I just got to see my baby one last time. Twenty thirteen Explorer. <laughs> this thing is quick. some of the drive home honestly. Ooh. Is that the 2020 Shelby? Dang that thing was dope. Dang, oh my goodness, that thing was nice. Twenty twenty GT five was nice. There you go again. <laughs> 